The speed of a ball is a cause for taking a batsman's by surprise, and a source of great enjoyment and entertainment for the opposite team and viewers. But have you ever wondered how the ball speed recorded in a very short interval of time? The speed of a ball that is displaced on screen is the speed of the ball at the point of release by the bowler. And at the moment, one common device is used to calculate the ball speed is the radar gun. A radar gun works on the physics concept known as wave motion. That device can emit and receive invisible waves, called microwaves moving with speed of light. To understand the behavior of these waves, let's observe a duck on upon a water pond. When a duck flips its wings, it disturbs the medium of the particles of water pond, hence creating waves, and these waves travel along the water. Notice that in just in one second, there are a certain number of waves that pass by a fixed point. This is what we call the frequency of a wave. Now, as the duck moves, the apparent changes. We see more waves passing by the fixed point in the front, hence increasing the observed frequency as compared to the actual. This phenomenon is in physics known as Doppler effect, and the same effect is applied by the radar gun. The microwaves produced by the radar gun have a certain frequency. When these waves incident on stationary ball, the waves will reflect back with no change in frequency. But when the ball is traveling towards the radar gun, then the frequency of the reflected wave greater than the emitted wave. And this change of frequency of emitted wave and reflected wave is detected by the radar gun to bring live speed at the moment. Since 2001, an alternate technology has been used to calculate the ball speed. That is, Hawkeye. A separate video on this topic is available in Physics of Cricket playlist. In last, do you know which fast bowler has high speed of releasing the ball in cricket? Comment it below and stay tuned with Explore Physics.